Hello guys, this is Cedric and today I will show you the Chain Sniper Bot version 0.9.5, the last one, uh, which is able to have many networks available now. We have uh, BSC, Ethereum, we have Qcoin, Polygon, Phantom and Avax. So all these networks are supported by the bot now. And I want to show you because I had a lot of questions about the easy mode. Uh, how it works, uh, I will make a demonstration just now. So first, we select here, we have one wallet, we have one wallet, we want to buy this amount, and I prepared a contract here. Uh, I will deploy it now. I will deploy this contract now. Okay, so now I have this contract address. I just have to put it, so I launch my mode, easy mode, so it's the mode zero. I enter my contract address here, and then the bot will start to scan this contract, so it will find the liquidity pool if there is any liquidity pool. Uh, it will scan also the amount of the liquidity, so now we have zero BNB of liquidity in this pool, so it's normal because I just deployed the contract. So, uh, we with this mode, you have to know it can bypass all the anti-bot measures like the tax, like the delayed trading, uh, and many others. So I will show you, for example, for the tax. Here, I set up my bot to have a trigger. Uh, I want to buy only if the tax is under 20%. So on my contract, I will set... Uh, more tax, so I have already some tax uh, for the, uh, the reflection and everything, but I will add also another tax fee of 50%. Okay, it's done. So now this contract have a tax of more than 50%. So the bot is still scanning here. I will add now liquidity. So you will see what happened in the bot. So I will add liquidity there my token. I want to add 0 0.1 BNB and then for this amount of token or 0 0.2, let's say. So I supply my liquidity, I create a pool. So this is what the dev is doing actually when he adds liquidity, he is doing exactly that. So he confirmed in MetaMask and now in the bot, you will see it's detecting the 0 0.2 of liquidity, but the bot don't buy yet because the tax is over my setting, as you can see. So now, let's say we have the tax like this for the two or three first block, and then the tax become lower after. So this is uh, anti-bot measure, anti-snipe measure. So. I will do it manually now. I will remove the tax. So I will just put 1%. I set the tax here. I confirm. And then the bot will detect the tax change. And now it buy the token. You see here the tax is getting lower. So now the bot bought the token. is also approving the token in PancakeSwap. And then we have the profit. Uh, of the token, so we have so it's uh, we have a profit negative because it's a new token, so it's normal, and then we have a tax. We also have the real profit. So this the real profit is when you include the sell tax. Uh, this is the profit you will have the real profit. So I will just pause here to show you what happened. So here we detect first the liquidity that we have detect the amount of, of the liquidity. When it detects the liquidity, it will detect the tax. So, and it will, it will wait. The tax is lower than your settings. For example, uh, you can set a trigger at 20% and it will, the bot will wait. The tax for buying and the tax for selling is under 20%. Then the bot will send the transaction. So this is the last line here. It will buy. It will confirm, it will approve the token in PancakeSoft so you can sell directly. And now you have the price stream. So now if we want to sell the token, I just press, you can see here I have my 
I have here a list of uh, hotkey. So control Q to sell uh, 100%, control the blah, 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 blah. And then if I press control Q, up the order, uh, the transaction is sent already and sold. Voila, we have sold and then we sold all the token we had. So this is how the bot work and then we are back to the menu. This is how it works. Uh, so as you can see, it's very easy. It can detect everything. Uh, also, if the token have um, a delayed trading, so that means the liquidity is added, but the trading is not started yet because the, the developer have to launch a function like enable trading or something similar. So the bot can also detect this uh, and it will buy as soon as it's possible to buy. Well, I hope this video helped you to understand how works the easy mode. As you can see, it's very easy. Uh, so this was for the universal mode. We have also have more function. We have a mempool mode. So the mode one, mode two, mode three, mode four, mode five are mempool. That means they can work even more faster. They will not wait. The tax is already down, but the easy mode is already doing very well. Uh, usually we can snipe almost every token like this, every anti-bot token with this mod. Uh, there is just one exception, but I will talk later. If you want to ask some more questions, you can contact me. Um, you have my Discord here. So where is it? It's here. Sorry. Voilà. We have my Discord here. You have the main chat where you can ask your question to people. Uh, you, we have uh, many users, we have uh, 450 users online. Uh, we also have private chat for the users. So for each bot, we have a private section. Uh, voilà, so you can join us, we can, you can ask us questions. Uh, my ID, if you want to contact me on Discord, it's uh, this ID. On Telegram also, I will anyway put it in the description of the video. So thank you for watching. Um, contact us if you want to join your team. Thank you. Bye-bye.